Welcome back guys. In today's video, what we're gonna be doing is getting all the parts painted. We got our uh, shocks here, uh, springs that we need to get painted. So we'll go ahead and paint those. We also got our lower control arms. A uh, buddy of ours uh, went ahead and sandblasted them for us, which was uh, awesome. They look great, so we need to get those painted. And we also gotta paint that one bar we painted earlier. We need to do one more coat. Um, of that. So uh, if you're new to the channel, make sure you're subscribed and uh, yeah, uh, let's hop into this. So we got our paint all mixed up and uh, now I think we're ready to spray. So let's start spraying this stuff. So we just got them finished. As you can see, they're nice and glossy, looking good. We're gonna let these sit overnight and dry. And uh, tomorrow we'll be able to see if they look good or not. Um, we do have to wait on these uh, bushings right here. Once those get in, we'll put it all back together and then be able to put it on the car. So uh, let's let these dry and we'll get back with you guys tomorrow. So it's now the next day. As you can see, they are dry. Um, so what we're probably going to be doing is uh, either putting this on right now or uh, wait until the next video to put it on. But uh, first things first is we're going to go uh, bolt up the upper control arms and uh, get the, the bolts put in on those and uh, see how uh, it looks. So let's go put the bolts in on the upper control arms and then maybe put this bar on. So let's go check it out. <laughs>
because it was very difficult to get it put up there. The bar was pretty heavy. But uh, as of right now, it's just gonna have to stay put down, not bolted all the way up until we uh, move this uh, jack and get it situated right where the aligned with the tires. So uh, we're just gonna let that hang right now. It is bolted up. It's not gonna fall down or anything. But uh, we do need to wait till we get this jack moved and all that so that we can uh, get it aligned. And we are gonna be waiting to put these on probably for a little bit just so we can get them exactly how they were before so we do not mess them up. Just so that the car is pretty much in line and then uh, so that when we get it aligned um, it's easy for them because old cars are harder to align than the newer cars so uh, yeah we're gonna wait for that alrighty so that's gonna be a wrap to this video guys um, we got everything painted and it's all dry and ready uh, to get ready to be put back on the car um, we're waiting on um, the lower arm bushings we ordered those they say two to six days so hopefully they're in here soon but um, once we get those all in, we'll be able to get them put back together and uh, we'll be able to put everything back together. Um, we will be going to a pull and pay uh, um, like lot here soon and getting the steering ratio box so we can get the steering all put back together and we can get this thing off the jack stands and uh, it'll be a rolling chassis again. And then after that, we uh, plan on uh, getting uh, this, uh, all the body work done or as best as we can and then shooting another thing of primer before it gets really cold out. And then, um, then we will, uh, after that, later down the road, we'll be getting this thing put, uh, lifted up and be able to do all the frame in that uh, Rust-Oleum paint. But that's uh, later down the road. But um, yeah. Uh, once we get all this done, we'll be able to lower it down and start working on something else, which hopefully we'll be done with this, um, putting all the parts on and all that here in uh, the next week or so. And once we get that done, it will be uh, on to something new. But if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and uh, check us out on Instagram. And that's gonna be a wrap to this video. See you in the next one.